This video will guide you through the installation of the Aperio Hub for RS-485. Aperio uses short distance wireless communication between the lock and an Aperio Hub to link to an access control system. You will first locate a site to install the hub, then connect to the access control system and finally mount the hub. For the installation, you will need the following. A 332nd flat blade screwdriver, a Phillips P1 screwdriver, and a single or double gang box. First, you will need to locate where you want to install the hub. You can install the hub on a wall, on the ceiling, above the ceiling, or in an adjacent room. Note that the hub is not rated for plenum ceilings. The hub should be installed within 50 feet of the lock and through no more than two walls. If you are installing more than one hub, the hub should be at least one foot apart. Now we are ready to begin the installation. The hub can be mounted on a variety of electrical boxes. Install an electrical box of your choice. Pull the wires through. Then attach the mounting plate with the long screws provided and cap with the plugs provided. You will add the Aperio hub after connecting the wires. Remove the wire blocks from the Aperio hub. Here's a tech tip. Remember the orientation of the wire blocks so the wires are connected in the correct order. On the wire block at J100, connect the RS-485 wires, data A, data B, ground and 8 to 24 volts DC. If you are adding more RS-485 hubs to the bus, extend the wiring to the next hub or terminate the bus using dip switch 8. Verify that dip switches are set correctly for hub addressing and termination. Dip switches 1 through 5 set the device address on the bus. Dip switch 8 is used to terminate the bus. Refer to your access control installation guidelines. When you are finished, the RS-485 hub will look like this. Wire colors may vary. Secure the hub to the mounting plate with the two short screws provided. To speak with our technical support department, please call 1-800-810-WIRE, 1-800-810-9473.